everybody welcome back today i'm coming to you with a super strength ginger turmeric shot i'm going to be showing you a quick and easy tutorial on how to make ginger shots with a juicer i like to add fresh ginger fresh turmeric lemon and black pepper so i don't add anything else this is going to be a super strength ginger turmeric shot and it's too easy to do i store them in these four ounce bottles in the fridge and i drink one in the morning and i drink one in the evening obviously the best way to consume these shots would be fresh daily but everybody's life is busy and we don't always have the opportunity so i'm going to make some for a few days so ginger is a superfood and it was it's great to start getting it into our diet i don't cook with it as much as i would like to so i do try to drink it in teas and i also like to make the ginger shot ginger and turmeric are spicy so these shots are definitely going to be pungent you guys can dig in further and do some research on the benefits of ginger and turmeric i'm not really going to jump into that i've already done research on that and i know how beneficial they are and so i do like to add those into our diets i haven't had them in a while because my whole foods has been out of turmeric for a good while i've been checking it and they haven't had it and i was happy to find out that they finally had it the other day so always when storing juice you want to have it in some type of airtight container the best way to make these type of ginger shots is with a slow juicer a fast juicer is going to be okay if you're going to be making them every single day and consuming them right away with a fast juicer the motor speeds up and it heats up and it kills off some of those medicinal properties so it's not really going to be in your best benefit to use a fast juicer and store these juices for long term that's not really what it's intended for it's intended to drink the juice right away a slow juicer it doesn't heat up it is containing more of those medicinal properties in those nutrients now you want to store it properly so that it can contain those for three to five days i don't have one of those pumps that sucks out the air so i try to make these shots for maybe two or three days and like i said one in the morning one in the evening and it will be for me and my spouse so i'm not going to be consuming all of this alone it's going to be between two people and we should be able to drink it within two or three days so without further ado let's get right into this video and get these super strength ginger turmeric shots this is the turmeric it has more of an orange flesh and it does stain it stains everything and it's definitely going to stain every stain every juicer and that's why i have a method that i'm going to show you in a minute this is the ginger now these chunks that are kind of thick like this i am going to cut them half these little strings if there's too much in there at a time it can damage your juicer and clog it up my lemon i add it whole with rind attached there's definitely nutrients in there as well and then I like to add black pepper at the end. Black pepper is gonna help your body absorb the turmeric. I'm gonna be using these four ounce bottles to store my juice in. And you're also gonna need a funnel. So I'm gonna go ahead and get my ginger and my turmeric sliced in half, get those chunks cut down to a little bit smaller pieces so that I can feed them through my juicer and not gonna clog up my juicer. guys so i'm gonna go in with a piece of ginger then a piece of turmeric then i'm gonna go in with some lemon so the lemon is gonna help get some of that turmeric juice out and help with the staining it's still gonna stain but at least it helps remove some of it i find that it helps remove some of it so i'm just gonna continue this technique and continue to go in with the ginger the turmeric the lemon i'm gonna continue this until i have gone through all of this in a jug look at that such a beautiful color so the next thing you want to do is get this strained off to just get some of that pulp out so it caught some of the pulp get this strained off one more time 
liquid gold. This is liquid gold. We need more ginger and turmeric in our life. Now this is the time when I like to add my black pepper. So the black pepper is just gonna help your body absorb that turmeric. I'm gonna do about that much. Sprinkle that in. Sprinkle that in. Then I like to whisk it in with my whisk and just get it, try to get it combined. So I got the black pepper all in there combined. And now I'm gonna grab my jars. And these glass jars, I ordered these off Amazon. They come in a pack of 12, I believe. I'm gonna just speak on Trader Joe's because that's where I usually shop. But I know a ginger shop there this size is $1.99. So definitely more cost effective, again, to make your own. I buy whole organic ginger root at Whole Foods. It's $3.99 a pound. And I get the turmeric from there as well. Now the turmeric is the most expensive thing. The turmeric is like $12.99. 99 a pound it is expensive but it definitely has its benefits and I feel like it's worth it just to add these things to our lifestyle and get them into our body so I have my funnel here and I have my little four ounce glass container here I'm gonna get this stirred up one more time just to make sure everything is incorporated and that black pepper isn't sit settling to the bottom and I like to fill it all the way to the top leaving as little air as possible in there. You can see the black pepper in there. That's it for the super strength turmeric ginger shot. It's real easy to do and it's all about just how you're gonna store it to maximize the shelf life on it and to get all the nutrients possible. So let's be mindful that this is a pungent shot, okay? Ginger is fairly spicy and turmeric is her cousin. She's not far behind it. So this is definitely gonna be a pungent, strong, spicy, super strength immune boosting shot. So if you're not used to having ginger and turmeric as a shot, you might wanna start with a smaller dose and then gradually up it from there or you could just use this as a concentrate and add it to like coconut water or some other type of juice or smoothie my little munchkin in the background here but that is it for today's video you guys please like comment subscribe and we'll see you in the next one bye